This Omix ADA exhaust manifold with gasket is for those of you that have a 91 to 99 Wrangler with the 406 cylinder engine. This is going to be a pretty much direct replacement for that OE manifold. However, this does have some improvements over that OE manifold that will help it to not crack in the future, which is a really nice feature. The straight six is a great engine, but it does produce a lot of heat and it also produces a lot of vibration both of which can lead to cracking manifolds. So a lot of the aftermarket, this one included, has a piece of flex pipe built here and here, and that's going to help absorb some of that expansion and contraction that happens from the heat as well as absorb some of that vibration to keep this from cracking down the line. If you've installed an exhaust manifold on your straight six, you know that it's not the most fun job to do. So. Having something like this where it's not going to crack again in the near future is going to be great. This is going to be a two out of three wrench installation, a strong two out of three wrench installation. While it doesn't require cutting, drilling, welding, anything like that, it does require a good bit of disassembly and then reassembly again of the engine. And some of those bolts can be a little bit difficult to get to. And we'll talk a little bit more about that install in just a second. Now from a price perspective, I do think this is gonna be pretty fairly priced. There are gonna be some other manifolds out there that have flex joints like this that may be a little bit less money. Some of those are not going to include your gasket, so you do have to keep that in mind. But even ones that do include the gasket, they might be a little bit of a thinner material, not as well finished. Some of the welds might not be as, uh, as strong, have quite as much penetration, just creating weak spots where you can end up with issues down the line. So I do think that for the price, you're getting a very high quality exhaust manifold. So like I said, this is gonna be pretty close to an OEM replacement manifold, but it does have the flex pipe built into it, which is something that you're definitely gonna want, especially if this isn't your first time replacing one of these manifolds. This is going to come with the gasket. That gasket is shared by both the intake and the exhaust manifolds. Uh, you are going to have to pull that intake manifold to fold off to be able to get to all of your bolts anyway. So while you have everything apart, you'll have a nice fresh gasket that you can put in, make sure you're not gonna have any sort of vacuum leak when you go and start up the Jeep again. This is going to be the same exact shape as that factory one. So it's going to bolt directly up to that collector without any sort of problems. And this does come with your two uh, studs for positioning it in place. It does come with two new studs and nuts. However, the rest of the nut and bolt hardware is going to be reused from your factory. So like I said, two out of three wrenches, strong two out of three wrenches, probably three hours or so by the time you get this thing uh, completely installed in the Jeep. The first step is going to be uh, removing the exhaust manifold from the collector from the rest of the exhaust system, get that disconnected. Then you're gonna have to re remove the um, intake manifold off of the Jeep. That will require removing the, the air intake, removing all of the throttle linkage, the kick down cable, uh, any vacuum lines, any electronics then you can unbolt the intake manifold. You will possibly want to have a fuel line removal tool handy when you're doing this step. You can get away with leaving the fuel line connected, but you always have a chance of damaging something if you do that, so I always recommend disconnecting it. And get that intake manifold out of the way, then you can remove all the bolts for the exhaust manifold, get that taken off. At that point, you'll start your reassembly by scraping the old gasket off, installing your new gasket, your new studs that come with this kit, installing the, exa the exhaust manifold, tightening those bolts down, install the intake manifold, getting everything else connected back up, and finally connecting the new exhaust manifold to the collector and the rest of the exhaust system. This exhaust manifold is gonna run you right around $140. Like I said, I do think that's a good deal. You get a very high quality piece here. It has those flex joints. It is gonna come with some hardware with those two new studs as well as your new gasket. These are really well put together kit that's going to hold up and work really well for you. So if you're looking for a replacement exhaust manifold kit for your straight six, I think this one from Omix ADA is an excellent choice and you can find it right here at extremeterrain.com.